Hey yo, good morning. Right now we're gonna go, I think, to the Telefree Cry, like I said before, yesterday. <laughs> uh, so you guys will get to see that. See you guys then. Mid to the top. <laughs> that was that was fun. Oh my! So the wildlife here is something that I personally love. There's the ringtail. There's the hawk. Mountain wildlife. Oh, okay. That's that's cool. Um. Got a map. And we got like a museum place. We got this, these birds. This Clark's nutcracker. The Cassin's finch. And the western tanager. It's violet green swallow. The yellow rumped uh, warbler. And the Nashville war warbler. And the red tailed hawk. We also got raccoons. And wait, sorry, that's a squirrel. We got chipmunks. And we got more squirrels. We got a bobcat. And we got the great horned owl. So all these things seem like really awesome. We also got rattlesnakes, coach whip, and the mountain king snake. That's awesome. And machine we got like the acorns and the birds. So yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> so I was just checking it out and here's this. Uh, the valley's faults, earthquake faults, crisscross this land and shape its restless landscape. Which is amazing to think that a long time ago this was not at all like this. San Andreas Fault cuts along the eastern side of the Coachella Valley. From where you are standing, it runs parallel to Interstate 10 toward the base of the Little San Bernardino Mountains. This fault forms a boundary between two massive uh, pieces of Earth's crust, the Pacific Plate and the North American Plate. Land on the west side of the San Andreas Fault is slowly moving northward past land on the east side at a rate of almost two inches a year. A few million years, Los Angeles will be San Francisco's neighbor. That seems to be very interesting. So right, so right, so right. I'm just going with the gut. Never had a doubt, felt like this is just a must. For me in perspective, I'm the deepest in the cut. Everybody tuning in, but this is just for us now. So that was a fun video, I think. I think the best thing uh, I could say after all that was today was really fun. Woo! I'm glad I got to. <laughs> I'm glad I got to um, go through an experience like that. It just adds to the list of amazing things I've done this year, and it's one of it's one of. Wait, <laughs> I'll read it off right now. Um, it says that it is the ideal getaway any time of the year. It is one of the world's greatest adventurous wonders, which is really nice that I got to do that too. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog as so much as I enjoyed filming it, and you guys, I'll get to see you guys tomorrow. I've said you guys way too many times. See y'all tomorrow.
find the right words And there's no way this is real life There's no telling you're the right girl So I can only say that it feels right It feels right It 